friends, happy Earth Day. To celebrate, we're going to draw a hand holding a plant. That's a great way to celebrate Earth Day by planting a plant. Yes. All right, what do we need for this lesson? A marker, some paper, and something to color with. All right, let's get started. We're first going to draw a sideways U. We're going to draw a U like this. And it's upside down. Sideways and upside down. So we'll start right here, draw right about here. Yeah, good. Now right here we're gonna draw a little line that comes down diagonally. Then we're gonna draw a line that comes across, horizontal. Then we're gonna draw another upside down U, diagonal like this, that's a little longer and a little shorter, or uh, skinnier. All right, you've got a great little finger. Okay, now we're gonna draw the bottom of the hand, so we're gonna draw a line coming down. Then we're gonna come up here, we're gonna finish our thumb, we're gonna draw a little curve that comes down like that to about there. Yeah, and then we're gonna draw the arm coming down. Now we're not gonna draw the whole arm, we're just gonna draw part of the arm coming down. So two lines, good. Now let's draw the soil or the dirt that's in the hand. We're gonna draw a little bumpy line, comes up like this, around, and then back down on the other side of his thumb. And when we fast forward the video, or if we go too fast, what can our herb friends do? Pause the video. Yeah, you guys can pause the video. All right, you ready to keep going? Yes. Okay. Now we're gonna draw the plant growing out of the soil. We're gonna draw a wiggly line that comes up like that. Then we're gonna draw another wiggly line right next to it, but watch, at the very top, we're gonna come to a point. Yeah. Now we're gonna draw another curve coming out to the right, and then we're gonna draw another curve coming down, and I started at the point, but then got wider at the bottom. Now let's do the same thing on the left side. Little wiggly line that comes out, and another line that comes back, but gets wider towards the bottom. <laughs> All right, that's a really good plant, buddy. All right, what's our plant missing? Leaves. Yeah, leaves. Let's draw one up at the top. So I'm gonna draw this curve that comes out like this, and then it's gonna come back down on the other side. It looks like a raindrop. Let's go up to a point, and then back down, and curve in. Now we're gonna repeat that same step over here come out to a point, back in, curve into the stem or the branch. And then let's do the same thing on the last one over here on the left, back in, curve in. And we did it, Austin, good job, man. We need to still do one last thing though to make our drawing look even cooler. What is it? Color. Yeah, we need to color our drawings. Now this part we're gonna fast forward, but at the end you guys can pause it one more time to match the same color. And you ready to fast forward? Yeah! Awesome, great job on coloring your plant. It turned out super cool and you can be really proud of your drawing. I love it so much. I especially love that blue outline. What does it look like? Um, the sky. Yeah, it kind of looks like the sky without coloring in the whole thing. Yeah. We hope you had a lot of fun drawing your plant. Yeah, we do. We hope you had a lot of fun and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.